Hi, it's Dr. Danielle Moore here, Clinical Director of Dermaface MD Skincare and Clinic since 2009. And as you know, we have a 30 day challenge to put together an entirely brand new skincare range. I have my Aerospace MD Skincare tools, which we sell a lot of and ship to Europe. I also have my Dermaface MD Skincare Hero products. The two main products are the Hyaluronic Serum and the Triple Peptide Eye Cream. I want to now launch a brand new skincare brand in 30 days, obviously in time for Black Friday and Cyber Monday. And I want to have three or four SKUs of topical skincare product. Look, if we get one or two to market, I'll be happy. But let's aim for, I feel like we should aim for three at least. And then I want to have different tools and facial adjunctons, as I call them, which are add-ons that will, again, three or six more of those. Those are easier to procure because the problem with Sorry, I'm a bit overwhelmed, to be quite honest. And my team have just left. They're like, you are a lunatic and we aren't entertaining this. They'll be back. They're just going to get a few matcha lattes and hopefully one for me. But again, it's a lot of pressure. We're already at a pressure time because we've just done a soft launch on Dermaface MD. And we're at the stage where we're getting brand ambassadors and affiliates, etc., etc. So they're fully busy with that. And here's me. Let's launch a brand new line of skincare but I want this to be a love letter to Los Angeles I want it to be like a baby blue baby pink and I feel like somewhere in there there's I keep going back to this yellow thing I love this yellow vessel but like I said you can only put black text on yellow I like yellow I want something yellow I don't know if I want one of the drinks to be like a champagne fizz yellow or something yellow I don't know but I'm getting pulled towards yellow but I do definitely feel like I like I go around the whole time taking pictures when I'm in CVS or I, I, I love Rite Aid in Beverly Hills I'm like a lunatic taking pictures in there and I take pictures of branding all the time. So, and then I just put them in a different folder for whatever I'm doing, or I don't know, I've just done it. I like these colors, the pinks and the Tiffany green and the blue and whatnot. Bear with me one second. I'm just, I've, I've a yellow product. I want to go through it and I want to test it out with you guys live. Okay, so I'm back. So, ugh, I've just spilt it everywhere. Okay, so I feel like I want to do something yellow, but I don't know what I'm doing because I also haven't tested that yellow vessel. So I don't know if product will be stable. So when you create a product and you have to go through all the different testing and you want it to work and the FDA approved and all that stuff, then you have to test the stability of a product within a vessel or a container. Like that's why I always find people who are doing slugging crazy because people slugging with Vaseline and Aquaphor, you're going to change the pH of your skincare product and the quality of it. But like, whatever, do, do you? So this is a new product. And again, it's kind of a face serum. It's yellow, but it's very runny. I don't know. And again, I'm going to put a little bit here, but again, you don't want to touch the dropper to your face. I don't know. No fragrance. I never have anything with fragrance. Anything I had fragrance in was the cleanser because there's a lot of astringent in it because it's like a really calming cleanser. I don't know about this. I don't know. What do you think of a yellow one? Yeah.